Today we're going to look at how to set ceiling dates and fixed due dates. So in order to get to your fixed uh, dates and ceiling dates, you're going to go to back office, library policies, and this is where you're going to decide which patron type you need to edit. So we're going to click on the edit pencil right here. Um, then you're going to use these dates right here to set your fixed due date and your ceiling date. So we really need to talk about what these do. So a ceiling date overrides the normal due date calculated by destiny. Um, so let's look at a calendar. Let's say that our last day of school is going to be on the 29th. You want all your books back, so you want to stop checkout on the 15th. If you have a two-week checkout period, if a student checks out a book on um, this Monday, if you don't have a ceiling date, that book will be due on the 25th, which is past the date when you want all of your books in. Um, if you have a ceiling date set to the 15th, then even though the due date is past it, that ceiling date overrides that due date, and you will have um, that book due on the 15th. Now, of course, if a student doesn't turn it in on time, you're going to have to go chase that book down. But that's what a ceiling date does. A fixed due date, um, those are used for checkout, checkouts of items belonging to a certain circulation type. Usually this is done for faculty if they're checking out like a cart that's going to be used all year long or um, maybe a remote, however, whatever is going to be used long term. So if you look, um, cancel this right here, um, if you look at our faculty um, patron type, you'll see that the equipment is a fixed due date. Um, so it's the professional collection, the reference collection. Uh, teacher laptops and videos. Um, these are uh, set um, when you enter an item and so you can use these um, for those long-term checkouts. What you're going to do is um, when you pull up a teacher and you check out that item, the fixed due date automatically applies. So that way you're not having teachers check out a card and two weeks later it's marked as overdue. 